I just want to make this quick video uh, showing you how I made a little drip irrigation system for you know like 10 bucks uh, first here's the part list I want to show you the receipt that I got so you got some three-quarter inch basically uh, a male thread that goes into the the hose bib essentially then you have a half inch um, inner diameter uh, that goes into this flex tube that you get which is held on by a hose clamp there as you can see and then the other end I have this half inch diameter that goes into the hose as well and then the other half goes into this half inch PVC adapter half of the coupling has threaded and half of it doesn't and you'll see why in a second so basically just turn everything on now I currently have my uh, sprinkler head on it already so I'm gonna turn that off for now but essentially I just hooked this up right here connected this hose the nice part about this hose and about this system is that it can always be um, set to a, a much smaller or much longer depth by just adding this so it's not a set 50 foot hose or 20 foot hose um, PVC I can always add couplers in the middle and extend it here's this how this ended up you got the hose clamp keeping the hose on there then you have the one piece the half inch threaded goes into the the male adapter there and then that just slips on so we're having a huge issue with weeds um, so I de-weeded all this put this landscape fabric down and then basically just ran this PVC the entire length and um, put some landscape fabric uh, staples down to hold it in place but as you can see I think it was like a 530 seconds I drilled but you get a nice steady stream directly to the roots of the plant before I had this sprinkler and I had a sprinkler head on it and it was doing the trick and these are uh, these are actually I know they look kind of dead but that's because these three inner ones we got pretty new um, but they're actually doing pretty well these outer ones are doing really well we had those last year and those seem to hold up just fine um, but I had the sprinkler and they, it was basically you know watering everything um, including the weeds the weeds were crazy before I started this whole project so just drilled a hole and you can see how it's going directly to the root system so no water is being wasted and I have entire I have entire access to this system so if uh, you know if the water's too tall or too strong when the sprinkler's on you just dial it back a little bit or vice versa but that's it obviously um, you know this is just part of the lawn what my plan is is to extend this PVC again which is nice because I can just leave that end on put a coupler put another 10 foot section of PVC on and then just put a, a T going straight down this way to do a drip system here I, I have kind of a drip uh, irrigation hose as you can see but it would be nice to just minimize um, the number of connections I have here so that I only need one Y or one T or whatever you call that basically a splitter coming from the hose bib there anyway that's all I got 
pretty simple to do. Just gotta have some glue and some primer for the PVC and then, you know, really basic knowledge of how to clamp a damn hose together. But that's it. I also added that tree back there. Bada bing. Bye bye.